Welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 4. I'm Burning Dog Face. Before we get started with this suicidal venture, I'd uh, like to give a shout out I forgot to make to uh, Flutter Sniper 13, who uh, gave me the uh, tip about looking for a peer and uh, well, tried to tip me off about the get yourself eaten. Easter egg there without making it too obvious what it was about. Yeah, that would have been very helpful if not for the spoilery achievement. Just wanted to reiterate, I uh, couldn't tell you what the other achievements of this game are. Wait! Ooh, I'm really glad I saw that. Well, I guess we do this the bold way. Oh, Jesus Christ! Holy shit! Not once. That was an anchor. Jesus Christ, it's massive. Fuck, how was I supposed to avoid that? I took a huge chunk of damage from that and everything. That's really creepy. Really? Can it not actually kill me with those attacks, or what? No health there when that started. I was still mashing buttons. Fuck! Can't even aim at it. The aiming with the stupid harpoons is even less accurate than it is with uh, the guns. I can wait. There we go. I don't think this is going to work, just for the record. But it should. Oh, where's the wall? Fuck you. But again, I took a huge chunk of damage on that. How was I supposed to avoid that? fucking bleeding this time. Oh. 
Fuck you! You communist son of a bitch! No, man! I was hoping to uh, put a little bit more distance between the you know, Tesla grad and myself before I ran into another uh, stupidly difficult boss. Fucking contrived is that fucking anchor. Also, fuck you. I give it. It can't matter if I throw a fucking harpoon into the tree, can it? Come on, holding L. I hit him and nothing, it didn't make a fucking difference. People let me know, is there a button I can press to go any faster than that, or brace myself or something? Seriously? Great. To use that technique in a long time. Where you just rattle your finger back and forth and along the button. And here we fucking go again! Ah, fuck! I hate this thing. Do not 
wand! Regular mashing! Mash that buton! You're a luggage, you piece of shit. Fingers got friction burns on it. Ouch! Okay. Okay! That thing's dead! He was lying on his stomach last time. <laughs> That's not good. Leon, it's been six hours since our last transmission. I was starting to get worried. Don't you mean lonely? Anyway, I started to feel dizzy, and then I guess I must have lost consciousness. Lost consciousness? Maybe that has some connection to what the village chief was talking about. Hmm. Can't say. But I'm all right now. I'm going to continue my mission. Why would she say that? What she would say is maybe that has connection with the purple shit they injected you with. Uh, how would they suggest that it was in connection with what the village chief said? I mean, obviously it is, but epidemic of something. Anonymous letter. There is an important item hidden in the fall hidden in the falls. If you are able to get it, you might be able to get Ashley out of the church. But I'll warn you, the route to the church isn't a walk in the park by any means. They've deployed what's called an El Gigan Gigante. So God bless. It really annoys me when they fuck up Spanish like that. But what's been going on in your body? If I could help you, I would, but unfortunately it's beyond my power. Um... Like when Hunnigan said that the cult was called the Los Illuminados... <sighs> Even I know that Los means the. I'm told that uh, Los Illuminados means the Illuminated. So... Hunnigan said that the cult is called the the illuminated and in this case I think El Gigante means the giant or the gigantic one so they've deployed what's called uh, the giant they've deployed what's called El Gigante so I'm assuming that's the next boss fight. I wonder who left that Man, it's dirty. Well, you're not wrong. All right. I don't need that many flash grenades. I can sell some the next time I find that dude. Nothing. It's been a while.
Nothing unu <clears throat> unusual here. I don't really need to do this, but let's just do this anyway. Yeah. Feels good. Why am I glowing? I saw that thing on his belt there when uh, I was going over the footage. It appears every time he goes to the uh, radio, because you can see him from the front. I wonder if that's a light. Man, I don't even have my jacket. Awesomeness aside, it looks fucking cold here. Also, I suppose it was pretty much inevitable that, you know, the survival horror game would take place mostly at night. Where the fuck am I? Let's try it again. Third time's the charm. Alright. And I still have that health boost. So, you know, I've got that going for me. I am not looking forward to El Gigante. Well, uh, that solves my problem. Or not. Jesus Christ! I am not getting close to that thing. You stay out of this. This is between me and whatever that thing is. Right now it's your turn. Damn it. Sorry, what was that? Five thousand Peter news. Oh, I don't like this at all. I can't believe this is still the village area. Hey, look at that! It's unlocked now. I wish there had been a moment where I could have fed some, uh, hapless villagers to Del Lago. I keep saying villagers, I guess I could just call them cultists. I mean, it wouldn't have, uh, made it, you know, the creature any more endearing to me, and it wouldn't have made that boss fight any more enjoyable. is that? Okay. Well, this is something I always enjoy about, you know, hitting the bad guys with their own creation and stuff. How much time do I have left? Almost none, actually. She is. Tell you what. Sorry, Leon. We're going to backtrack back to that typewriter. Well, I guess we uh, know one thing for sure. These cultists are definitely mutants. Jesus Christ, background music. Calm the fuck down. We're not even down there. Uh, 
Um, enough place to uh, wait out the uh, storm. Not that we're going to be, have the luxury of doing that, but you know. There we go. I have no idea what those things are. But I like those guys even less now that I know that some of them have horrible monsters inside their bodies. That being said, I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Resident Evil 4. And considering the day that these uh, episodes will go up, I hope you have a happy Halloween, Burning Dog fans. Later.